Frankie, we got some Macs from the UK, some Macs from Australia, a Mac we tried before. Today on Mark's Mac. Good day, mate. Couple different Macs, yeah? Two kind of rapid Macs. This one from the UK, this Kraft Macaroni and Cheese original. And this is when you add boiling water to. Chicken Cheesy Easy Mac from Australia. Which we actually tried the Australian Easy Mac last time when Keith was on. Keith only comes on Australian yes. based yeah. for some reason. Nope. I won't show up unless it's Australian. Yeah. <laughs> but it didn't have cheesy chicken. Yeah, so maybe we'll get a little chicken flavor. The 99p special Tropical Sun Mac. And we're gonna have a do-over. So this is the one with the tin of cheese. Yes. It's gross. I don't like it's it. It's awful. Nope. Oh man. It, it actually tastes like like cardboarded pasta. We're gonna see if it's gotten any better. Maybe it is. Remember the, the whole fancy a bubble and a squeak and all that? <laughs> yeah, it's, no, they've, they've updated the text. For a quick and easy bascola, saute together some chopped bacon and sliced mushrooms then stir through the pasta with chopped spring onions, yum. A tin of red salmon and your favorite char grilled veggies Veggie spelled with one G. Will give your next bowl of mac and cheese deluxe an irresistible edge. We also have Vegemite. You put it on buttered toast. Right. So we're gonna try it on a cracker and we're gonna try it on a toast. Yeah. I'm really excited to try some Vegemite because a couple of years back, Frankie and I, we visited Sydney, Australia for a film festival, the Sydney Underground. Right. On the way back, I bought some Vegemite, which got confiscated at the airport because of airport rules. So I never got to have my Vegemite. They also confiscated my bottle of wine that we won from the film festival. Yeah, which Aww, is really upsetting. You know, it's a nice souvenir. Right. Frankie, this is the first time this toaster has ever been used on Box Mac. I just like the point. Uh, I thought you were gonna say ever yeah, been that's used. That's what I thought you were gonna say. <laughs> I actually, I only really use it for bagels and it's not very often. You ever come across like a gourmet bagel? People are like, these are real fancy bagels, yeah. and they're not pre-cut. Cutting them with the knife that you've been provided, which is often a butter knife, because mm -hmm. that's what you're supposed to spread it with, and you end up like actually somehow cutting yourself because you're trying to <laughs> dig so deep into the... You cut it halfway, you cut it round. It's a lot of work because you have yeah. to saw through you the whole thing. You mean my bagel already sliced in half? When you're invited to like a bake, like a thing that has bagels. Yeah. And there is no slicer and it's just unsliced bagels, but they have big tubs of cream cheese. So they, they, they know that that's the point. Yeah. On one hand, it's brown and that's gross. Yeah. On the other hand, it's cheese spread. That's good. Frankie, would you kindly butter this toast? You gotta put a little bit of butter on it. All right, All right so we do. just a nice thin layer of butter. It's gotta melt. Oh my God, tell the doodle burger story. We met somebody in Australia. I'm gonna call, I'm gonna say named doodle burger. <laughs> He took like some sitcom that they really all yeah, liked. Yeah, it was something like It's that. kind of their full house, basically. Yeah. And he did, you know, basically like a bad lip dub, making them say na naughty things and stuff. <laughs> You're fucking coming home with me right here, right fucking there, you little fucking And he was a an executive user of the C word. Everything was C word. C word this, C word that. Ways I've never heard it used before. Like at one point we were helping them bring like stuff out of the car and he was like, yeah, just C word it out my way. <laughs> <laughs> he was mostly amused by himself and not really by anybody else mm -hmm. until Keith came along. Because we're at this, the underground Sydney Film Festival. There's like a lot of crazy videos, not politically correct things. And everyone's dressed up in piercings, tattoos and yeah, whatnot. Uh, and I'm, I've got like a, a tie. We argued, I was like, no, they invited us. Doodle Burger approaches me and he's like, you're like, Captain Business. Captain Business over here, what a C word. You're gonna have him do Captain Business? Captain Business. The musical? Give us a little bit of Captain Business performance art. That's fucking Captain Business. <laughs> This does not look appealing. Oh, Why, because it's brown? It's cheese spread. How could it be bad? Mmm. It tastes like cheesy toast. Yeah, it's not bad. Yeah, it's fine. Why is everybody so grossed out by this? Because the name. It's like vegetables and mites. I'm having like big bites of it and I'm liking it. If you used way too much, it would be really gross. All right, Vegemite on crackers. I've prepared this boiling water mac. It's boiling acid! Boiling acid! Oh no! It's boiling acid! Batman, man! Batman! I mean, all it is is like yeast, right? Yeah. Yeast extract. Yeah, it totally just tastes like cheese bread. With a little bit of a yeasty edge. 
Maybe a little bitter. I need another cracker with a big glob on it. We're talking like this? Wow. Yeah, let's do it. Salud. <laughs> <laughs> Truly, this is the cup of the king of kings. This is what I was. <laughs> this certainly is the cup of the king of kings. What are you laughing at? I'm just laughing at you know, just me closing my <laughs> eyes is what I was doing. Yeah, it's really good. How about tongue down? Tongue down. Bow now 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 now. It's just cheesy. Yeah. I say we, we gotta bring at least Vegemite cheesy bite. To, to the States? To the US. Oh yeah. Same basic looking cheese product. Canned cheese. A score the outside. Scoop it out like a cat. This is the UK Sachet Mac. They said just fill up the mug with water. Do you guys remember what this tasted like? Yes, I do remember what it cheese tasted like. Cheese whiz and cardboard. Yeah. Maybe we should throw a little Vegemite into the Mac. No. Ooh. Butter subs with Vegemite. <laughs> no. <laughs> Scoop of gross cardboard tin. It actually looks really good though. It does look really good. What should we start with? I guess Tropical Sun. This is like just standard Mac from the UK probably. Yeah. All right, let's see. Real cheap. Tastes like... I think it's fine. Yeah. It doesn't taste different. No. <laughs> there's, there's no like hint of Australia or anything else. It always smelled like uh, tea tree and eucalyptus. Yep. That was the soaps, the shampoos, and just the general area. Well, should we go on to Australia? I guess so. I don't remember it looking this good. Seems better. It's significantly better. It's better good. than I remember. Yeah, it's like it's, really... It's, it's actually, I really like what this. What the hell is going on? What, where is the cardboard taste? Was this not the cardboard one? It is. I mean, all I know for sure is the last time when they sent it to us, like the box was obliterated. Maybe we were eating something else. <laughs> something sinister. <laughs> something <laughs> from the past. It's <laughs> Something from the past. It's got a really nice, rich, sticky, cheesy taste. It's pretty good. Sometimes you have to try your Mac <laughs> twice. This Mac's way better than the, when we last had it. Does this mean we're gonna have to do second all round of all of the Macs you've Mac ever done? Was like, yep. Evol truffle coming right We're in. coming up on 100th episode, <laughs> Box Mac V2. Round two. Yeah. This one is just about as done as it's gonna get. It smells real strange, doesn't it? No, I'm done with that. Yep. Oh, Ooh, it's yeah. awful. I'm gonna wash that down with some of the it's other. It's like flooded bland cheese. The pasta became total mush. Ugh. Ugh. Chicken Easy Mac, have you ever even encountered a meat Mix in Easy Mac? No, never. Okay, we need four minutes in the microwave. We had a fussy baby waiting in the wings. You wanna try some Mac? Some Australian Mac? She doesn't wanna try any crap Macs. Well, she looks a little dreary. Hello. Would you like to go to the Australian Film Festival? Would you like to meet Doodle Burger? You should definitely have, yeah. You know what, while we're waiting, Keith, take a little plate of Tropical Sun, which is a totally just standard Mac. Let's mix in a little Vegemite okay. and just see what happens. Yeah, sure. You're the canary in the coal mine of Vegemite Mac and Cheese. It might not look appetizing, I would not recommend it. Yeah? <laughs> it clashes with the other cheese. Yeah. Mappy, how you doing, Pappy? You having a good day, Pappy? How you doing, Pappy? Pappy, how you doing, Pappy? Having a good day, Pappy? How you doing, Pappy? Pappy, glow. Are you looking at Keith? Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. Well. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I do. I make faces at children. I like cook out some things. <laughs> Strange children. Ooh, the chicken is reeking. The chicken is reeking. Reeking. The Keith, chicken the chicken is reeking. Keith, the chicken is reeking. Frankie, the chicken is reeking. Gloria, the, the chicken, chicken is, is reeking. reeking. I heard the chicken is reeking. Box Mac, exclamation point. Some might say it's chicken AF. So, not good. <laughs> It's that bad. I don't think it's that bad either. It's, it's not a macaroni and cheese. I don't taste cheese. It's just I taste a chicken little soup. bit of cheese. It's got chicken soup flavor. I mean, fair enough. Actually, in terms of a microwaved only product that you don't add anything else to, it was okay. It's one of the best quality Easy Macs, even if it's not one of the best flavored Easy Macs. Yeah, sure. I agree. It, it, it doesn't taste bad. If you like chicken, then you're all for it. So that's it. Some of our rarest, some of our, our longest traveled mac and cheeses. Yeah, and, and I was really kind of, I'm shocked how good this was the second time around. Next time they see us, we're going to be celebrating 99 episodes, and then shortly after, 100 episodes, it's gonna be Christmas time. Oh my gosh. That's gonna be one heck of a show that time on Box Mac. <laughs> one that you return to. Someone.